And what else are we demonstrating to the North Koreans, Kim Jong-un, uh, as our uh, national security apparatus continues to talk tough, right. uh, deliver nothing? It's now, we're now over six months into the process, and the, suddenly the Trump administration finds itself on the brink of being exactly where the Obama administration, the Bush administration, and the Clinton administrations were. That's what worries me. I think, uh, look, let's be blunt, uh, the H.R. McMaster and some of the National Security Council, I'm not convinced is actually trying to break the paradigm. Uh, Lou, uh, President uh, Trump's already sent him back, sent H.R. Uh, back and, and the staff back on the Afghan plan, which was essentially a, a cookie cutter of the same as, as thing we've done and not one for the past 12 years. So this worries me as well. So one of the things I heard today, for example, is that H.R. Uh, McMaster has not fired a, a number of the staffers who worked for President Obama. As a matter of fact, uh, those who worked for uh, some of the staffers, uh, uh, Ben Rhodes, for example, while Ben Rhodes is gone, his staff is still there. Do, you, do okay. we really believe that staff? It's like having a rattlesnake next to your bed and thinking somehow if you're just nice enough to the snake, it's going to be not, it's not going to, it's not like that. So, Lou, I think the, the president has been someone who actually was successful in delivering expectations and outcomes. Right. H.R. McMaster and company are, have been brought up through the military to simply follow the rules, follow the process, and if you don't win, that's okay. And I think there's a mismatch of what the president wants done and what the staff and people like H.R. want uh, simply believe their job to be. And this is something I think is not serving the president well. Yeah, and, and or, nor the American people. The American right. people intend that this president have exactly what he has demanded, the vision that he has articulated as a candidate Precisely. and now as a president for more than six months. Uh, it is stunning to me that there was no accountability. There were no